I'm so sorry, you guys. I don't know what happened. I'm back. <laughs> um, Tina Rash, your health and wellness consultant. Um, if you just popping on with me, um, again, this is my second scope. Something was going on with my phone. Good morning, good morning. If you popping on, tap the screen. Please share this with your followers. I'm so sorry. I don't know what was going on with my connection, you guys. Good morning, good morning. Thanks for um, joining me. If this is your first time being with me this morning, my name is Tina Rash. I'm your health and wellness consultant. And what we do here is we get healthy together at 8 a.m. Central Standard Time each and every morning. So today, y'all, we're going to be talking about three reasons why you need a planner. Like I stated earlier, school is about to start here. Good morning, Rich Knight. Um, running my business from home. I'm a health and wellness consultant. I'm a health care provider. In addition to that, I'm a wife and a mother. And I strongly um, participate in things at school. And in addition to that, I have other clients, but I also have a coach that helps me. That's helping me learn and grow. Like I stated earlier, I'm an empowered queen, y'all. But anyway, I'm out here this morning because I have to run out and pick up some products. So that's another reason why you need a schedule, a planner in place to help you keep structure so you can write down where you're going what you're going to do what time you're going to do it and at the appointed time that you're going to have to do it you don't want to just be jumping around all over the place uh doing this and doing that and it's not planned because things happen things pop up and if you are not planned good morning citrus 777 how you doing girl thanks for popping out and share this with your followers if you are not planned or you haven't scheduled yourself, you're going to waste a lot of time, which is not good if you have other things to do. If you have other appointments, such as myself, I mean, you're going to miss out on some. Some, some going to go lacking, right? So you got to put that plan in place, that schedule in place, so that you will have structure, so that you can stay on track. Oh, thank you so much for the hearts. Thank you. Who's giving me those rare hearts? Thank you so much. Y'all tap the screen. Show me some love. So, if you have that planner and you have it written down and you check it off as you go, then that'll help you keep up with good morning. That'll help you keep up with what's going on throughout your day. Number two, know where you're going. So, you've written it down. Um, you got the time set. You know what you got to do. Okay. But know exactly where you're going and what you're going to do. Don't go to um, Walmart or Sam's or um, Big Lots or um, Publix shopping. And you know you got to go in there. You got to run in. You got to get some items. You got to pick some stuff up. Okay. That's good. You got your list. You done wrote it down. So you won't um, overspend. But okay. When you get there, you inside the store, you shopping, this, 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 and this. You get a text message. Oh, girl, they got a sale over here at um, Shoe Carnival. Or um, we are meeting at um, Chili's for brunch 11 o'clock now you already out doing what you got you taking care of your stuff it's 9 30 already okay you get this text message um why are you in Publix or uh office depot walmart wherever you at picking up items and you get this text okay let's meet this 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 and this okay what are you gonna do are you going to run over and have lunch with somebody at 11 o'clock you may have a 10 o'clock appointment already scheduled in your planner you may have a 12 o'clock appointment I already scheduled in your planner. So what are you going to do? Are you going to accept this invitation? Or are you going to tell that friend, well, okay, I'm so glad you thought about me. But I got to take care of this, 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 this. I got to handle some business. Because, I mean, at the end of the day, you go and eat brunch with somebody. And we all know how it is. You get together with somebody you ain't seen them in a minute. Your family member, uh, your co-worker, your church member, um, your congregation member. Somebody you just hadn't seen in a minute. Your classmate. And you get together. Okay, you talking. You chopping it up. 
what's gonna happen time gonna get away right and if you haven't scheduled this time out um for yourself the right way well guess what you gonna miss out on something that's real important especially if you have a session plan with um a client or a potential client or a customer and you off you know you you kicking it you shooting it with somebody which oh no ain't no wrong with that having lunch you know winding down but you gotta take care of your business first you know work now play later you know it's it's okay to um have a, a brunch with a friend or have a dinner with somebody